Hello everybody and welcome back to Life is Pain. Today I am going on a mission to retrieve my stuff from whatever killed me. I honestly don't remember at this point. I did a big pause in between the last video and this one. I just know that I died. Um, so I need to go get that stuff. Man, really, what did kill me? I have a mass amount of confusion. Ah, here we are. Gripstone. Give me all that back. Oh. That's one of those wizard trial thingies. I have no clue if I'm up for that. If I am going to do that, though, I want water first. And then when that happens, then I have friends. Like that, I had taken down my first, uh, my first real wizard shrine. Creeper was trying to spoil the moment, though. It died and paid the ultimate price. Paid the ultimate price. In there, I found an amulet of recovery, magic missile, stormy crystals, and whatnot. I. What does this do? When on less than 50% health, mana from your armor will be used to heal you over time. Unfortunately, I don't really wear mana-infused armor, which means that's going to be useless. But I'm going to put it in that slot for now because that'll... It's a slot filler. This is quicksand, isn't it? Placing things. Oh dang, this box is loaded. Another dragon spirit. Darn it. I would have rather had a regular flamethrower. At least this advanced tome of Arcana should make me do cool things with my dicks. He's got a little baby sword. He's got a little baby sword. E nope, 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 no, nope. place is loaded up with all sorts of nautical nonsense. Whatever do this building hold? It hold anvils and that guy. What is he? Foglet. Mystery. What the he What even is this game I'm playing? I'm so confused. I'm playing Sina, Silent Hill or some crap. Can't believe I made that jump. I thought I would fall for sure. But like seriously. Ooh, brewing stand. And an invisible chest with nothing in it. Great. An invisible chest of nothingness. Fantastic. I was on top of the world. And besides having like no ammo for my stranger, I, I had managed to find a brewing stand. Once I had found the town, I had also filled my back a pack with many various trinkets, which was pretty darn nice to have. Now all I just had to do was figure out a way to get down from here without dying or taking a ladder, because honestly, who could be bothered? Luckily for me, there was invisible vines that I couldn't see the whole time. There are two medics. And that heavy is getting healed by the both of them. Alright, that's one medic down. Hey! That's my first contract done, baby.
Can't hear yourself, huh, medic? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, I had a ward, baby. I had a ward. That means give me all your stuff. Oh, wow. They're dropping all sorts of things. Huh. It looks like we're getting a radio interruption for this broadcast. We shall resume promptly, but you... That's the wrong building. Let's go back to the one that I busted the windows on a little bit. And, uh... I mean, it won't be any time for you, but I just need a break for a minute. <laughs> I heard the Charging Scott. Where is Charging Scott? Oh, there you are. Hello. You're not on my team, huh? Oh, now you're dead. Oh. You've got a friend. You had a friend. What's with all these slimes, man? Tre these are treasure slimes. Heck yeah, I love treasure slimes. <laughs> Oh, that's way more effective. That is so much more effective. So first what I did was I upgraded my wand so that I could do higher level spells. Then what I did is I grabbed that old shadow ward book I have from four million years ago and replaced it with a regular ward. I also put in these two new books in those slots because I've got no clue what they do so far. And then what I did is I gave my book this lit upgrade called the condenser upgrade and basically that just means that I regain mana over time without even doing anything which is pretty freaking nice now I'm gonna sleep in my bed and then when I wake up from my sweet beautiful dreams I will then drink some dirty water and then when I'm done drinking dirty water you know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna test those new spells and see what they do this one Ah, Ray of Purification. Okay, that's lit. Static Aura. I'm not really sure how that works, but, um, yeah, so basically I have a laser beam now. Laser beam. I bet that just melts through mana. Anyway, so the next thing I did was, I, I saw an ammo belt thingy, which would be... Super easy to make. I'm not really sure what it'll do, but I know where it goes. There's a slot for it in my inventory. If I stick that baby right there, it's gonna glitch through my armor every so once in a while because it's not an animated. It's not made to go with animated. Does that mean I can? Okay, cool. I can stick ammo in my ammo belt now. Cool. That's gonna save me space. It's gonna save me a bunch. Of Base. Also, I have my ring of searing embers, which makes my fire spells disintegrate things, and amulet of recovery, which is gonna do me like no good in all honesty. Um, I might, if I find a good set of magic armor, I might actually start using this stuff, even if, even though it's pretty light. Um, I don't know. We'll see about that, but at the time being, I was actually thinking about making a disguise kit, since that only seems to take one Australian, um, one paper, and four iron ingots, which is better than anything Saxton Hale has offered so far. And like that. We have a disguise kit. I'm not sure how useless or useful it will be. Time to find out. Oh, you can disguise as straight up everything. Huh. I guess I'm a dire wolf now. <laughs> the animations don't work too good. Let me pick. Oh, it, it's got a durability on it. Uh, crap. Uh, let's see. Can I? Uh, Reaper. Oh, I can go through player skins. 
That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to look up the mob. <laughs> Let's see. Because it's a it's a mob that does not burn in the day. Neither are wither skeletons though. Huh. Looks like my water's freezing up pretty good. Thanks to the winter. And in the storm, still blowing around a little bit, but still, it seems more like it's actually blowing by than doing anything else. Is that my weather thing doing that? Yeah, save it for, per, or put it to prevent block damage only. So I got more ice cubes. Um, yeah, I guess my disguise kit's not going to be very helpful in actuality. Mm, maybe I could disguise as something when I go to the nether, but I'm just going to keep that in there for emergencies. Uh, in the meantime... Oh, I could go to I could go to one of the wizard's tower and get a master wand. Let's do. I'm gonna grab crystals and that thing and gold because those seem to be the most popular choices of the wizards. And then I shall look at my map upon it being daytime. Okay. Do I have any wizard towers that are specifically named? That's a summon Zom tower. Uh, I, I'll I'll go to this wizard tower because I got a good feeling about it. But anyway, we had a big productive day of getting all that sorts of stuff together. I'm probably s actually no, I'm not gonna have to go to the Nether. I was gonna get ender pearls from Endermen and, and there's another biome that spawns a lot of Endermen, but I forgot it's not in this update. So here we are. Um, what are where are we at on time? Yeah. Uh, this, sorry if this is, ends up being a short video or something, because like mostly all I did was just uh, look for blaze rods, but uh, I guess we're gonna go on the international hunt for Endermen and stuff like that. So if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, I hope to see you in the next one. This is Past Sesbiff saying goodbye, and I'll be done with boot camp soon, hopefully.